everybody. I am so excited to share this video with you today. Obviously, I am camped on the lake, but what I'm sharing with you today was previously recorded on To Meander, which was a YouTube channel that I used to share with Robert. And so I have pulled this today because it is very special and I will soon have current videos for you. I'm currently camped with Frugal RV Gal and we are hitting some state parks and headed to Lollapalooza. And I camped with my friend Beth in Colorado and those will be coming up soon. But for now, enjoy today's video, a blast from the past. We're just taking it easy here this morning. Giselle is fixing breakfast, so we're gonna go over there in a moment. And Patty and I are cleaning out our vans. It's a never-ending process. Hi, everybody. Today, you get to meet my friend, Patty. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> and she has already done a video with us about washing dishes. And today, we get to tour her awesome rig, which is? A 2018 ProMaster 2500. Awesomeness! <laughs> Patty, thank you for showing us your home today and showing us your rig. Let everybody know how long you've been out here on the road. I've been out here for three weeks. And it's just the week after Christmas, not sure when Robert will air this, but she came to camp with me because I was having a hard time uh, during Christmas. And we actually met at the To Meander meetup. Yes. Thank you for coming to that. So you came to that pretty much straight out of the chute. I did. And yeah. before that, you went and camped with the caravan for a while, right? Yes, with Caravan 2. Caravan 2. And then she came to the To Meander meetup and now is camping with me and our friend Giselle and going to show us her wonderful home, which at three weeks will probably go through a lot more reiterations. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, so we'll check back with her in about a year and see, or maybe even six months and see what she's done for an <clears throat> update. But for today, let's go see her beautiful home on wheels. Okay, so Patty, tell us about your solar system that you have here. It's very unique. Oh, thank you. Right now I'm using a Goal Zero on a tripod and it's two 30 watt panels and they're connected to my Goal Zero uh, lithium battery which is a thousand watts. I love that tripod awesome. and you just lift it up and put it on there so easy every morning. It, it, it's nice and it can move to follow the sun and it tilts. It's a really nice tripod. So you don't have to do like I used to have to do and go and pick up your heavy suitcase panel and move it around all the time. You just come out here and turn it. Yes. That is so nice. This is the back of my vehicle and I have my tools back here on these two husky totes. And then I have my shoes back here in two crates, shoes and boots. And then I have my shower back here, which is the 13 gallon big kahuna. And I also hang my coats up here, so they're readily available. It's just lovely, Patty. Thank you. This is my pie cabinet that I had in my home, and I decided to bring it with me um, until I decide how I want to build out the van. So I, I needed um, something that was steady, and so I flipped it over. It's actually upside down, and it holds a bunch of my little knickknacks on top of it and inside is all my food and dishes and pots and pans and on top is your Berkey and yes here's my Berkey it's a travel Berkey they're really awesome you can um, there's videos on how you can take pond water and put them through them and they come out it comes out drinkable it's a really wonderful system I bought it about a year and a half ago and I've been using it before I got on the road to make sure that it was what I needed and I still love it a year and a half later. This is my Dometic. I believe it's a 40 liter and it plugs into my Goal Zero and I really love it. It sips uh, wattage so it's off right now and every like 30 minutes or 45 minutes it'll come on for just a few seconds and keep it cold at the setting I set it at. I can set it to be a freezer or a refrigerator. This is my Camp Chef stove, Everest. I really like it because 
I just have to push the button and the flames come out and I can cook. So I just turn on my propane, turn this knob on and push the button and it lights the, the burner. It's a really nice stove. It has wind guards and it folds up nicely and it has a case that comes in. All right, so Patty, I noticed that you have a lot of lovely things in your home and thank you for having us into your home today. Thank you. And so tell me about like your dishes and what am I looking at those paintings on the wall? These are antique tiles that I really love. And eventually when I do my build out, I want to be able to, to grout them into a backsplash for a sink countertop. Oh, that's going to be lovely. So you are going to do the insulation and have a finished out van. You just, you're, you, I want to remind people, you've only been out here three weeks and haven't had a chance to do that yet, but, but it will get done. And you have been collecting this stuff for a long time to build your home like you want it, right? Yes, I have. And tell us about the beautiful dishes because people are going to ask. I have, um, Polish pottery. I, my daughter and I went to Poland and, and uh, on a trip and, and bought a bunch of Polish pottery. I I really love this stuff. I'm, I'm working on a system right now to keep everything secure so nothing breaks, hopefully. But um, in the meantime, I, it brings me joy and I love these dishes and it has good memories. So I, I brought them with me. Well, I really appreciate you sharing your home with us. And, and I know it takes you a while to get ready to, to run down the road, uh, <laughs> turn that key and go. But it, all of these things mean so much to you. It is worth it to you. Is that correct? It is. It is. And if, um, if they break, I'll make a mosaic out of them. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm, it, I, they bring me joy. So for now, I, I have them with me. Nothing here is, is um, it's not a built out van. Nothing's fastened down yet. Everything is, is I'm trying to figure out what works and, and I'll get, I'll get there. And, but you fasten it down. I don't want anybody writing oh. in and going, you have to fasten no, it down no. before you yeah, travel. Everything's and... <laughs> ratcheted down and, and everything is wrapped up and, and safe and, and, and um, for now. But I mean, there's no... You don't have any built-ins. Right, no yeah. permanent build-out. I'm getting there. I want a cabinet and drawers and, and all the nice stuff, but baby steps. That's right, baby steps. <laughs> well, I'm so proud of you and you've been planning this for a long time. And again, really appreciate you sharing your home with us. Thank you. Oh, thank you, Deborah. We are celebrating because we are having dinner, homemade chicken soup from Giselle in Patty's home. Patty said it's her ho her housewarming, her nomad housewarming. <laughs> the soup is delicious. It is. Yes. Thank you, ladies. You're welcome. <laughs>